Mel, is that you? I was only... Oh, hello. You must be the new aspirants. Welcome to the chapel, aspirants, and my congratulations on making it through the gauntlet of Samson. I am Sister Preacher Fealty Mayweather, wife of Evangelist Malediction Mayweather. I'm sorry my husband could not personally tell you of the church's static, but he is unfortunately too busy with his holy duties. May I help you? The church vigilant is the eyes and ears of the church. It gathers information through observation, study, and the confessions of sinners, then passes it on to the church ecstatic for review. An aspirant who wishes to enter the church vigilant must be studious, strong of will, and a good judge of character. The church militant is the arms and legs of the church. It protects us from the heathen hordes and helps spread the word of God by accompanying our preachers on their crusades. An aspirant who wishes to enter the church militant must be strong and courageous and ready to give his life for the cause. The church ecstatic is head and heart of the Salvation Church. We are the ones who interpret the teachings of James King and Red Samson and turn them into law. We are also the ones who bring those teachings to the lost and wicked of the wasteland, preaching the good word and welcoming into the church those who wish to follow the path to salvation. An aspirant who wishes to enter the church ecstatic should be intelligent, charismatic, and ready to spend several years studying scripture and canon law. I would of course welcome you to the ecstatics, but if you haven't visited the other branches of the church, please do so. They have much to offer an eager aspirant. A whore and a defiler of innocence. A seducing witch who lures good, upstanding men to adultery and debauchery. I pray that God strikes her with the most virulent of diseases and makes the rest of her life a misery. Certainly not. I've heard stories, that's all. It has nothing to do with me. The paladins are my husband's bodyguards and his most intimate confidants. They are the bravest, more loyal men in the church, if sometimes prone to arrogance. N no, I have no problem with the paladins. It's just, it, it just seems sometimes that they see more of my husband than I do. But that is the nature of their job, isn't it? Who, who told you that name? He was my, my late husband. Please, forgive me. I don't wish to speak of it. It's nothing. I, I fell against a candlestick. I appreciate your concern, but it was an accident, nothing more. May God light your journey, Rangers.
Welcome back. Have you decided? Oh, well, I would be happy to discuss your choice with you anytime you choose. Just let me know. What is this? I know that eye. I know that green. Tell me how you got it. Tell me. Oh, merciful God. Why did you let this happen? All this time, I've blamed myself for being a bad wife, for not loving Malediction as I should, for letting him drift from me into sin because I could not please him. And now, I learned this, that he killed the man I loved to have me. No wonder he repulsed me. No wonder it was such torture to lie with him. By God, if only I was strong enough to hurt him, if only there was some chance at vengeance. You want evidence of Mal's corruption? Oh, I have that. By God, I do. He would take pictures, videos, himself with whores, with penitents. Then he would flaunt them at me to show me how he wished me to perform my wifely duties. Just wait here one moment. I'll be right back with everything you need. God light your journey, Rangers. <laughs> <laughs>